So I've been doing some rapid expansion early in this game. That's not good. Um, I've got to I've got to fix my empire. <laughs> but the problem is this. This really upsets me. The fact that Dog came in here and swooped up on the city. Um, I don't necessarily have the authority for this. Um, now you need the authority value to to be at a level for you to to have enough cities. Uh, it, that doesn't make any sense, Drew. Uh, the authority needs to be high enough for uh, you to have, like, so I, I only have two authority, which means that because I have, like, what, how many cities right now? Five cities at the moment, settlements, I guess I should say, uh, means we're we're not technically supposed to be able to manage this. Now, uh, Civil War things won't really happen this early on, uh, but they will definitely get worse with time, and that's, and that's the issue. So, what I think I'm going to do is um, we need to get rid of this settlement. First of all, there's no way for me to protect it, and there's not really an easy way for me to get up a second settlement. There's This is crap. All of this. Just, pfft, what is that? Just, pfft, that's bad. I don't want that. So, uh, we're going to disband this. Yes, we're going to disband the settlement. Sorry. And uh, they're automatically going to get put back into settlers. So, it's actually all good. It's actually all good. We got some nice, nice people ready to settle another city. What I think I'm going to do with those guys is put them back in the capital. Maybe hold on, to, hold on to them for a little bit until we get the technology to level up our authority. So uh, that is going to be the priority. But I'm not letting Dog off the leash. No way, Dog. I am not going to let you off the leash. So we're going to declare war on these guys. And I'm sorry. What, what can I say? We got to do it. So I'm going to declare war and uh, goodbye. We're going to walk into your city, take it over. And, uh, and hopefully we, you know, we get some stuff out of it. I don't want to be at war for too long, though. I really, really don't want to be at war for too long. So you need to go come into the city. Good. You need to come into the city. I think we have somebody else here, too. That's right. So we'll press forward. This should be all right. Uh, another thing is something else that I learned over the break is that the more I have my, my, my peasants uh, out here farming consecutively, building roads, all this other stuff, their unrest is going to grow. So if we look into this unrest screen, labor service. That's not good. Dissatisfaction, as well as culture helps with happiness, at least for the peasants. Nobles only like culture. I think they, they, they like culture significantly more, though, than the peasants. The peasants also like food surplus, which is what I'm trying to give to them. What, uh, you, yeah, you're working hard, but I'm trying to give you for food surplus. Okay, so we need to stop with the, all the farms. Definitely. Uh, also, another thing is that when our population gets too high in the capital, we need to upgrade to a city which will allow us to get more building slots up and uh, and people won't be as upset because we're a little crappy town and maybe the population gets too high so there's not enough, you know, there's homeless people, things like that. That's not good. So we need to slow down a little bit. Um, I need to tell everybody, You, we need to probably stop with just a little, I mean, you know, yeah, let's, let's, just, let's just finish these four farms and then we'll chill for a little bit. That will be the plan. Uh, in terms of the other cities, we probably should chill in some of these other places too. So you guys can chill. Actually, you know what? You've got no peasant unrest. Okay, never mind. Never mind, Ben. You're going to start working for us real hard. Um, okay, and then this city maybe would want to chill. They've got actually very high noble unrest. Again, culture will help the nobles be a little bit more happy. And then the inefficient authority is what's going to kill us. So we got to be careful of that. Now, we've definitely got a lot of time here. I mean, it's only turn 19. We've been doing a lot in 19 turns, but... uh. We have some time, so it's not a it's not a huge deal. Okay, so what else? What did we loot? Okay, we looted some stuff. Nice. Um, we've got we're losing money at the moment. Uh, I might disband a few, a few, just a few of uh, because we've got a, a huge army, anyways. Uh, not yet, not until I peace out and try to get something out of out of the dog here. Um, chi decreased. This man has recovered from the grievous. Grievous? Is that a word? I don't know. General Grievous? Wa <laughs> wound? He suffered in battle, but it has taken its toll. Okay, that's fine. I, You know what? You can do your thing. It's all good. Player eliminated. Very nice. And, uh, you know, whatever. We, we're still defending ourselves from those bandits. We need to worry about that. Dang, I had a lot of people die. Indecisive battle. Huh. That's, that's kind of weird. Now, I've got these guys on their way, and I'll back up, and then we'll kind of form a, a nice... A nice little army right there to protect us from the bandits. Another other thing, another thing that I need to keep in mind is that I'm not necessarily allowing some of my troops to, to rest. Gotta let them relax sometimes. So we're gonna want to do that too. We gotta keep an eye on their stamina. 
especially out here in the west because it's gonna be it's gonna get pretty crazy because they've just continued to move and move and move so we got to watch that all right so here we go so we should be able to walk into the city because they pretty much stole this from us with like a handful of men which is totally not cool we'll go a little bit faster um actually you know what we don't even need to watch this we already know the city is ours for sure and this is good because this is really our only neighbor uh, for quite a long time, you know, as the as, as the zoo or however you want to pronounce it, we uh, we don't really have very many factions around us. Building cup upkeep, most buildings have an upkeep cost. Yes, um, so we can't really we shouldn't really buy. Try to only build. Okay, well goodbye. Actually, there we go. Try to only build every type in buildings in each settlement. Don't try to build every type of building in each settlement. That's cool because it kind of diversifies your empire. So that's a uh, that's nice. So if I could peace out with these guys now, that would be great. That'd be fantastic. Come on, dog. Let's do this. Let's get a peace deal going. You got to give me something for it, though. Give me, um... I mean, you're definitely not down for that. I don't think you're going to be down for any of this. I don't know how strong your military strength is, which we haven't looked up statistics. We have not looked up statistics. You know what? I've I found it it's better to wait for the AI to come up to you. We can chill here. We'll let everyone's stamina kind of increase. Yeah, you kinda of go in there and it's all good. Let's let's look at this, because we haven't been able to look at this. Number of settlements. Perfect. So we just pushed the dog down to three. We're up to five. I think that that's that's pretty good. Um victory points. We're technically winning. Who is this? Oh well they're dead. And then the bandits don't count. I'm wondering I'm pretty sure bandits can take cities though. I've had several bandits try to take cities, so that's kind of interesting. Yeah, we are significantly stronger. So they should be coming up to us like any point now and asking for a peace deal, I'm assuming. Because they probably don't want none. How, why did you not get here? I thought you were supposed to get here now. And yeah, you're going to chill. Although, wait a second, is there a farm? There's not a farm because those bandits will pillage tiles. So there's not a farm right there in that tile, so it's fine. So we can go forward. Oh, 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 wait a second. Is there... Did I miss something? A band of worthless and uh, desperate men have taken... Oh. Where did... I didn't... I did not see that part. Okay. Hmm. Do we want to just go take them down? I guess we'll go... You know, let's just chill for a little bit. Let's, let's not do that. Well, maybe. Maybe. Okay, fine, fine. We'll, we'll do it. We'll do it. Uh, let's check out these battle reports. Uh, we, they had 82 men uh, die. Dang, that siege, these sieges cost a lot. What's up with that? Narrow victory. Uh, and then for the bandits, whoa, indecisive battle. How did 47 people die in the corner there? How did that happen? Oh, are you not very strong? What are you? Maybe you shouldn't be taken on. It looks like they're about the same. <laughs> That's not good. All right, well, let's keep an eye on this. So we've got this bandit battle taking place. Whoa, there are, are quite a bit of bandits over here. A lot more than I thought. Okay, well, we won that one. Oh, it's because... Oh, okay. I was going to say. it's. I, I was... I got confused for a second there because they had swapped spots. Well, it looks like we're killing a little bit more this time around. I think we got some backup coming too. Let's take down the bandits and it's all good. Now, if I absolutely need to, I can I can disband this town as well. We don't necessarily need it. These are two cities that are really close by to each other, and I don't think that was a good idea for the AI to have done. I was hoping that they would allow... Oh, you know, we'll take you on. Their stamina is pretty low. Maybe we shouldn't... Hmm. Let's see. Let's have them... Oh, I can't have them sleep. I mean, I guess we can come out there and face them. And let's let's have you chill for a little bit, too. I don't know. Maybe we should just peace out these guys. We got the city that we wanted. I know that if I wait a little bit, he'd probably give me something. His power is weaker. Truce for 20 turns. The thing is... Oh, he's not even down for 20 turn for truce. He wants... Oh, yeah, he is. 
Oh, he's not going to do this. I, this is still a very confusing system to me. I do not like this. We offer peace. You give me money. Oh, I guess... I guess so. Well, whatever. I, they just gave me a bunch of money. I'm cool with that. I probably could have asked for a little bit more. I don't think they had that much more. They, there's no way the AI had that much more. Okay, so... Um, we need to relax for a little bit. We need to relax. And uh, we got settlements coming back. Or settlers coming back to our capital. We've grouped these guys up together. Okay, and we've uh, made... Horse domestication, that's good, because as this faction, we'll be doing a little bit better with cavalry units. I need to do horse riding, though, as well. Well, what is this going to do? Yes, we need to increase authority, actually, so we're going to need to wait for that, for the horses. Uh, settler? Is settlers now available? Oh, okay, we don't want to recruit anything. Nope, I don't think so. Definitely not yet. we got a few farms. How do these battles go? I'm kind of scared. Okay, 81 bandits died. Uh, that is not what I was looking for. Kind of a tie here. Battle of Ben. That was, uh, that was the one in the north, northeast. And then we, okay, yeah, that was, uh, that, well, that was for, a, was, I don't even know what this was for, but we lost a lot of people. I'm glad that we pieced out. And we got all this money. Okay, good. Uh, let's, let's go back to building things inside of the capital. What, what do we want to, what do we want to do next? I know that I for sure want to start to... Trade, yeah, produces bronze for trade. Um, these are military buildings, though. Actually, we want the bazaar. That's right. Trade value multiplier by two enables overland trade within twelve hexes. Increases internal trade by fifty percent. Okay, yeah, let's get this up next. It's only gonna take two turns to build, and then we might want to queue up right afterwards. Oh, we need, yeah, we need forty population. Not worried about defenses. We do need a palace, though. We do need a palace. Ooh, that's gonna be expensive, but we can probably get away. With, well, let's wait. Let's wait. Let's wait. I don't want to. I don't want to commit to anything just yet. Are we good? Yeah, we've checked on everything. Okay, very cool. There are. There should be some people that aren't doing anything, so that's fine. All right. So where's this battle taking place? It's here. I. I guess those other rebels might have. Or I guess I should call them bandits. Well, we just sent a 37 stack versus 119. I hope that they all don't die. Don't run away. That could have been way worse, so I'm glad that... I'm I'm glad. Oh, did you just die? Yes, you did. We killed a leader accidentally. <laughs> oh, dang. Yeah, that ain't good. I don't know who I just killed. Had no idea these rebels would be... Uh, so powerful. I gotta zoom in more often and actually like look or at least click their flag. It doesn't even look like they got that much. It don't look like they got that much. Lands pillaged. All right. And uh, I don't even want to look at the battle report to be honest. Oh, okay. It's not. It wasn't. It wasn't terrible. Okay. Let's move forward. Okay. Good. Okay. We sh we should we should handle this now. I mean, this is like my main army. It wasn't good that my leader died, however, it's going to save me a little bit of money, having, because <laughs> I was going to disband units anyways. Are they leaving? Oh, okay. Yeah, so I was going to disband units anyways. Okay, they left, or they're dead. No, they're not dead. We need to do something about this. All right, how did that, how did that go? I know they pillaged our lands, but, you know, what are we going to do about that? There we go. That's that's much better. Now I know that we got a an, we, we got a new leader. We should have gotten a new le new leader. Yeah, here he is. So he's gonna get like a certain. I'll keep the leader there. I I don't think we already have somebody in this big army. Yeah, this guy's good. Uh, obviously, our new leader still kind of sucks, but that's fine. Let's give him a break. Let's have him chill here for a little bit. Very glad I pieced out, right? <laughs> very, very glad that I pieced out. Alright, so we have some time. I know that we've been building a few farms. Have you finished here yet? No. Alright, so we're just going to stop with the farms for a second. Because I've been having... We've been building farms and farms and farms non-stop inside of the capital. It's maybe not the best of ideas. 
Economically, though, we're doing better, and we're also going to get a bazaar, which is going to help out trade. Dang, where are all these rebels coming from? Well, luckily, we kept that leader there, and again, I can always recruit a few. And actually, I can send this army back. Here's the thing, though. I've got to explore. I can't just sit here and not do anything. Uh, I, I definitely need to explore and, uh, and and look for those quests. Look for those... Um, Whatever these things are called. Got to do, we got to do more of that. Okay, so precious metal work. So right now I'm looking for anything authority. There we go. There's authority, but that's going to take 15 turns. Increase culture. Okay, let's increase culture and enable the construction of Jade Scrape. I don't know. It's going to just be a lot faster. So that's kind of why I'm down for that. Fire in the capital. That's not good. Let's check this. Let's check this. Population killed six. Six? Terrible fire has sweeped through the settlement, causing widespread damage. Well, that's not good. I don't know if it's terrible. Stored food. Well, that's good. And we have a bunch of food stored. It is winter. So I'm assuming that we're going to want lots of food stored. Food production. Yeah, we had six people killed. That is That is actually quite a bit. That's not good. I don't know if I can take these guys on. How, how big is this stack? Yeah, I think we could try it with the leader. I mean, he, I'm not sending the leader out to, to his death. I don't think. <laughs> okay, so they're going to try to unite. I don't know why these guys are here. You know what else I'm going to do? I'm going to have to recruit a few. So this is really good, though. Unrest has gone down significantly. So that's good. Um, I want to keep... Geez, I don't know if I want to get some peasants in, involved in this. I only have the option of getting one more noble up. These guys are more expensive. I think we need to get up a few. Here, let's go north gate. Oh, I can't. I can't. Okay, then let's go east gate then. And I guess we'll just get some light spearmen. Maybe I'll do two. We'll do, we'll do something like that. And then, and then we'll have them, boom. There we go. Okay, that's that will be a little bit better. Because we've got to be careful of these bandits that are coming down as well. So this is, this is part of the problem with early expansion. Which is perfect, because I didn't get to experience this with one of my experimental playthroughs in the closed beta. We didn't see this as much. So I'm very glad that... Hey, can you get involved? Can you go help out a little bit? Or what, man? Let's see. There they go. Okay, good. Okay, we just flanked the crap out of them. They better all be dead or something. I hope so. And uh, and they're running. Okay, perfect. Let's just see the results of all this. These bandits are still coming. Hey, we chased them down. Very nice. Okay. I feel better now. Uh, make peace with who? Did you come back? I don't know how I don't know if that's supposed to be cuz I'm pretty sure you're dead. Unless they can come back or something. Keys are the key to a successful game. Success. I gotta say, key to a successful game is managing your finances. Yes, I realize that. However, make enough military units. Yeah, 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 yeah. I get you. I get you. Um, news of peace. Let's just check on this battle report. Nice. We only had one person die. That was tremendously successful. Cool. So I'm gonna have to stop right there. Looks like we're gonna have a little bit of a better, a uh, little bit more of a stable video in the next one. But we'll see. So we had a big bandit issue in this episode. I was not expecting that, but it seems like we finally got a, a good grip on this uh, by now. So I think in the next one we'll focus on probably exploring and still kind of getting that unrest down in some of my settlements or towns, one or the other. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys. I'll, I will see you guys next time.